Uh, anyways, we're here at the BTO Open for 2023, and this is your all levels, all um, access pass to the first class on Friday afternoon. We started off nice and simple, guys, with a starter step. I'm going to have you pop the knee for a one. We step two, go three four, triple, five, and six, float the followers away, four, seven, and eight. We went into a double hand hold. Leaders, because I'm gonna ask her to rotate, I'm not gonna keep the hands level like normal. I'm actually gonna go a little high and low. When I go into a high-low position, that tells her there's something different going on, and then I'm actually gonna roll inward. Leaders, what I want you to think about, you're gonna fold her just like a normal left side pass with a fold. We're gonna take that left thumb and we're going to go thumbs down. Followers, when we feel that, our left hand goes down with thumbs down and I put the fold onto the low of my back, not my leaders. Leaders, all you're going to do with this hand is bring it to the shoulder. Do not lead with this hand. All the lady is in this left hand, so it's going to look like this. It's going to break one, two. Notice the high-low position. Here, we're going to wrap up for three and four. Send her out for five and six. From here, we're going into a nice sugar tuck. One, two, again, the high and low positions, and then let her on out. Typically, leaders will do a right side pass or a fold or something. We ask them to do a right side pass with a closed position, right? Followers, I'm going to take this left arm and sneak it under and give it something different to look at. So instead of going one, two, and he catches me three and four, and we finish the pattern for five and six, I'm going to let my leader have a different option out and by doing that is by placing my body in a different position so how to do that at least for this pattern followers as he steps me through one two I see that hand come up like he's going to close me off and I'm like oh yeah I know what that pattern is going to be because I've seen that before right I'm gonna go here I'm gonna rotate take this left hand and basically block it up and sneak my head under and then pull it away from work. So then we have this two-handed cross hold. From here, Nelson has a myriad of patterns. He can give a reverse whip, he can roll me in, tuck me out, whatever it is he wants to do, and it gives him something different to do. The whole count for that is going to be all one, two, three, up number four, go five and six, and then you get to choose your exit for the class. Cool. So that was your whole class, guys. Hope you enjoyed it, and we'll see you Next year. The social focused event from